exotic sports cars, the best sports sports teams, and this, the Enzo Ferrari, the best supercar on the planet. Ferrari had a clean slate of paper when they designed this car. They could have elected to design the fastest car in the world. Instead, they chose to design the most complete car. Handling, ride, acceleration, and braking. It's all here in the Enzo Ferrari. Enzo is one of the most high-tech cars ever produced. The entire chassis and body panels are constructed of carbon fiber. Note the Formula One inspired suspension. The Formula One gearbox. The 6 liter V12 producing 660 horsepower, 483 pounds of torque. It does not get more high-tech than an Enzo Ferrari. Enzo does 0 to 60 in 3.3 seconds with a top speed of 218 miles an hour. To bring that speed down, Ferrari installed these carbon ceramic brakes. The entire car is Formula One inspired, from the way the air flows over the nose to under the under tray. The air intake is heating a massive engine and cooling it as well. The spoiler here comes up automatically, providing downforce as does the Venturi tunnels, literally sucking the car to the ground. Ferrari only made 399 production Enzos and one more for tsunami relief. One of the gentlemen who gets to own and enjoy this car is the Air Rat. Welcome to here. Thank you. So you are a full-on enthusiast. I mean, you've had some incredible cars. Describe the Enzo compared to everything you've had. The Enzo, I mean, I have had so many exotic cars in my life, but there's nothing as nice, as fantastic as the Ferrari Enzo. Whenever I get in it, I just don't know how to describe the feeling. It is such an amazing car. It puts you in a mind frame that I cannot describe. It is, it is wild. It is so crazy. What was the deciding moment for you when you just said, you know what, I'm getting this car? It was uh, two years ago when I was in New Orleans at a car show and uh, I saw five Enzo's and one of them was the yellow one and that's where I fell in love with the yellow and so I wanted to sit in it so bad and luckily one of the owners allowed me to do that. I sat in the car and at that time I said, before I die, I have to have Thank you for allowing me to be even with this car. It's been such a privilege to be next to the Enzo. It's a monumental car in the car world. Stay tuned next week. We're actually going to get in the end.